All right, guys, so if you don't know who I am, I'm obviously John Bartholomew from Mohawk Valley Wellness, and I'm trying to put out some non-fitness-related information, some things that I think can help us all really achieve more in our life and honestly live a better life, live a more fulfilling life. What I'm talking about is this absolute black hole, this time suck, this nasty, nasty thing that is social media. Right? And now you're saying, well, John, you're on social media talking about this stuff. Correct. I think there's a great use for social media. Obviously, we use it for the facility to push our message, and we use it for marketing, and we use it for advertising. Right? But I think the vast majority of stuff out there is, is trash, is garbage. Right? And you become addicted to it. I was completely addicted to it. I, as a 33-year-old 33, 33 man who preaches discipline and discipline and discipline, when my alarm would go off, I would unlock the phone, and on my way to the bathroom, before I even get in the bathroom, I've got this thing glued to my face, and I'm scrolling. This phone and the social media enslaved me. And I'll admit it, I, I would do that every single day. I don't know how long I did it for, years? So I did a hard reset on my phone, and... It got rid of all the browsing history on the phone. And now I refuse, absolutely refuse to go onto Facebook on my phone. Absolutely refuse to do it. Um, so what I'm saying is the amount of time that was wasted scrolling and scrolling and scrolling. What are you looking for? What was I looking for? I'm not going to come across some, some, something that's going to make me proud or some defining moment, right? And I'm not saying that all social media is bad, but I'm telling you the amount of time that gets sucked into this phone that can be doing other things like having an adult conversation. If you guys haven't had a good sit down conversation with me in a while, I would love to have a cup of, co cuppy, a cup of coffee with any of you guys and sit in the office and I'll talk your ear off for an hour. Those of you that have done it, you know that's the absolute truth. I love stimulating intellectual conversation. I love hearing ideas. I love hearing other people's point of views. I love these different things. But you don't get that when you just mindlessly scroll and scroll and scroll. And it's crazy to think how much time is spent on that. There's studies that say people are checking their phone over a hundred times, 150 times a day. So if you do that for 30 seconds, you log on and you scroll for 30 seconds, which is probably low, and you do that 120 times a day, which we know is true. I admit it. I, I'm on that thing. The second amount of bed, that's an hour a day. That's an hour a day. So when I say, oh, I'm so busy. I don't have time for meal prep. I don't have time for the gym. I don't have time for this. Bullshit. I spend an hour of my day scrolling through primarily nonsense. Now, I'll tell you that the videos that I try to do are things that help you guys out and, and some positive things. But the vast majority of stuff on there is, is useless. It's posturing and it's people putting stuff up there that, that doesn't have any direct impact on your life. So again, I would highly recommend ditch the social media to a certain extent. Maybe you allow yourself, hey, I'm going to jump on there for 30 minutes a day, 10 minutes a day, 5 minutes a day. I'm going to check it once a day and get some paper in your hands. Read a book, journal right I think to myself if I want to be this and what I'm doing are my actions going to bring me to this goal and if you don't have a goal and you just love stewing in your own pot of averageness and not succeeding in life keep scrolling baby keep scrolling knock out that Instagram knock out that Facebook knock out that snapchat it's it's think of anybody that you know that is very successful in their finances, in their relationships, in their education, in their business, in anything. I find it highly unlikely, unless their business is social media, that they spend a ton of time on these different platforms. And again, I could be wrong. I've been wrong plenty of times. But for me, it was liberating not to be enslaved to that phone and to the social media and I would encourage you, if you know that, especially you're watching this at home, you're watching this in your car, that you know that's you, get rid of it. Cold turkey. Get rid of it. And you'll see how you're jonesing like an addict. You're jonesing 
for that, that Facebook. I tell you, it's not a good thing. That's my two cents. I'd love to hear your comments. Share them below. I'd love to have a running dialogue. And that whole offer of, hey, let's sit down and have an adult conversation about anything. Fitness, social media, the book you read, something. I don't care. Let's talk. Have a great day, guys. I look forward to seeing all of you.